In 1963, I took a trip, actually won the trip, to Malawi where I went to visit my friends Jeremy Thorne, who was in my class at boarding school, and Justin Thorne, his older brother. Their dad was a well-known lawyer in Malawi. This was their home, and that was a pawpaw I just got down from the tree. What we have here is their home and uh, Jeremy and Justin on the front porch and pointing at me. There we have the town spread out below and the mountains, typical of that part of uh, Malawi. We, and that would be uh, Justin's girlfriend at the time. So I went to visit them because I had to take the trip somewhere and the, they were the only people I knew in another part of the country. So we stayed there for a week or so and we went for picnics out in the country. Um, people in Malawi would drive up and down the lake and uh, find lots of picnic spots along the way. This is typical of mountains anywhere in the world. This isn't. We have, I think, uh, it was Jeremy having a little fun there with his brother's girlfriend. And here we have local forests. And it looks like we're exploring them. More picnics on the rocks beside the water. A beautiful spot. Lots of beautiful spots like that throughout the eastern highlands of Malawi and also Zimbabwe. And then it goes down the other side of the mountains, goes down to Mozambique and the coast. By giving his sons names that began with the same letter, Mr. Thorne managed to get one of them off the hook for a charge of being outside after the curfew one night. Um, he produced the other brother in court and said, You're, Are you Jay Thorne? Yes, I am. Were you there when the officer says you were? Oh, no, I've got lots of witnesses to prove I was elsewhere. So they got off. Here we are on the way home, back to my hometown, Luanshe. Um, we don't have an airport there of this size, so um, we flew to Andola. Now we're flying over the more typical part of uh, central and western Zambia that's more flat. Now I've returned to Luantia and I used the rest of the roll on the street right outside my favorite dairy den, looking across to the Northern Motors, which was a very successful car dealership, repair place, gas station, where my dad bought all his cars and had them all serviced. Car buffs will love the old models here, some of which you don't see at all anymore, even in collectors. Um, and here we have Oh, oh, Vauxhalls and Standards and Volkswagens and that was a Chevrolet. My dad is checking out somebody's license on their Volkswagen. I don't know why, but he was a bit of a joker. Thought he was just posing for the camera there. Somebody taking their dog for a walk. And on the corner there is Theo's Cafe in the far distance where families would take their kids if they'd been good for an ice cream on Sunday.